All right, you know that saying, membership has its privileges? Well, at the Jacksonville, that definitely holds true. Jacksonville Zoo. That's, That's right. Wait, wait, what did I say? You said just Jacksonville. Well, that too. There you go. <laughs> That's right. My family and I are members at the zoo because as much as we go, it's well worth it. But they also offer some really cool experiences for zoo members. And one of those is coming up this weekend. Hey folks, Curtis Dvorak here up at the Jacksonville Zoo. And this is what an almost eight month old human looks like. And what he's looking at is what an almost eight month old flamingo looks like. And I'm joined here by Danielle Buck, one of the bird keepers up here at the zoo. And who, uh, who's our lovely friend here, Danielle? So this is Phyllis. She's one of our female greater flamingos and they're found in Africa. And, and she's ba she was born about eight months ago right here at the zoo? Yes. And she has, a, she has a few brothers and sisters, right? Yeah, she has six other um, juveniles that live with her. They all have different parents, um, and they're all about the same age. And so they've been being hand-reared for the last uh, seven months, and there's a really cool opportunity coming up on March 16th, right? Yes. What is that? So we are offering to our members um, to come out and watch our flamingos walk down the main path. So the members, members only? Members only. All right, so how, how, I'm a member, my family's a member, so what time and, and what has to, how do we have to be here? So they're asking um, people to be here at 7.45 to 8 o'clock in the morning, and then the Flamingo Walk will start at 8.30 a.m. Very cool. So if you join the zoo and become a member before March 16th, you'll get to escort Phyllis and all of her rugrat named <laughs> brothers and sisters <laughs> down the main path. Very cool opportunity up here at the Jacksonville Zoo. Go to jacksonvillezoo.org to get all membership information. You wanna go pet the flamingo? 